Crash Bandicoot 4 is about time, but if I don't get a Platinum Relic, the video ends. Whoa! Let's get this started. Oh my god, is that radical? Alrighty, we're on the Rude Awakening, we have to get the timer right here, so we start our Relic run. So, the Relics are basically time trials in the Crash Bandicoot series, and there's three, well actually there's four Relics. There's Sapphire Relics, which are, you know, the easy ones. There's Gold Relics, which are also pretty easy, but they're kind of a bit more challenging. There's Platinum Relics, which are required for, you know... 106 completion and uh, last but not least the Twitch Bravo developer relics and those are like the last one that last one is very I mean very impossible to get like it's really you have to be I mean real good but platinum relics are required for completion 106 completion actually specifically so for the platinum relics you have to be real good you have to time your you know jumps and everything you have to memorize the whole stage and be I mean I mean real you have to be real quick. One mess up can prevent you from getting the Platinum Relic. So you have to be real, real good. I mean, some of the early stages are not that bad the Platinum Relic. But the later stages, especially like uh, the later worlds of the game, like it's really, I mean, really impossible to get one. I think I got like, what, 18 Platinum Relics, I think? I'm not sure, 10? I gotta check for like, I have like, you know... I mean, really. You have to be really, you know I mean, really good. Like, to get the Platinum Relic. You have to be like, you, say it. you can't die at all. You can't, uh, slow down at all. And there's also this move right here. You have to triple spin. You have to spin the, uh, or square button, or any other button three times to, in order to, uh, get the shortcut right here. It's nice to come in handy. And I'm not sure the, uh, Relic one, but, yeah. Okay, there we go. Pull it up. Get the Platinum Relic. Get the Platinum Relic. We get the Platinum Relic. And there we go, get the Platinum Relic. And then the, I see the developer Relic's 39 seconds. That's like near impossible. But yeah, got a Platinum Relic. There we go. And now we're on to Insanity Peak, which is the second stage of the game. And uh, not be as bad as all. Well, we got C because I mean, oh yeah, I missed the box right there. You have to, you have to, know, you have to like break at least most of the box. Damn it. Uh, yep. Uh, you have to that over there you have to uh, it'd be like like you had to be real fast you can't slow down at all like one mess up you had to once like you can get a a, a good recovery oh, I almost, almost died from there okay anti right there anti right there so you know once you explode you get more uh ooh. I'm very good, like, you know, the platform memorization in this game. Well, not the last world as well, but most of the game I know well. There. Okay, double jump. Double jump. Double jump. Okay. Do it. There we go. Okay. On to the, uh... Missed that Aku Aku. Crap. Nope. Should be good. We should be actually you now fine here. Nothing here we can stop us. Must like a TNT crate or nitro crate anywhere. Okay, lost our Aku Aku. Okay. Oh, got our you know. Oh, almost died. It wasn't for that. Uh... Hey! Let's see. We got the relic. Hey. Whoa! Whoa! Ding! 